everybody, what's going on? It's your girl Merle, and today we're going to be trying a recipe by my dear friend, who I've never actually met in real life, Gordon Ramsay. Oh my God, is that the angry vegans coming in to attack? <laughs> I know a lot of people, specifically vegans and vegetarians, don't like Gordon Ramsay. I find the man very entertaining, and frankly, I'm overjoyed that he has started making vegan recipes. Today we're gonna to be trying his vegan spicy bang bang cauliflower. And I wasn't sure if I should do this one because I'm like, cauliflower, everyone's had cauliflower wings, like, is this overdone? But you all said you wanted to see it, so I'm doing it, and we're doing it now. And let me just say, the fast pace that he operates at in his like 10, Gordon under 10 minutes, whatever, is wild. I'm excited to see that he's using his experienced culinary mind to focus on some vegan dishes for all of us. So we're gonna put some olive oil in there. I got it over like a medium, medium high heat. And the first thing we're gonna do is add our red onion. I feel like Gordon today. I feel like... I guess that's what going to culinary school will get you. All right, and he said we're basically gonna let this red onion melt. It's an interesting way to describe it, but whatever, Gordon says. Gordon, Gordon, Gordy. You think anyone calls him Gordy? No, they wouldn't dare, right? Gordy. Like his grandma, maybe? Gordy. And then in the video, he said, now we're gonna add some freshness. So we're gonna add some freshness. Some big old chunks of ginger. I like the way he talks and the way he moves. He's always moving and talking at like a million miles an hour. And he's just not even thinking or looking at the measurements. He's like. And this would be about the time that Gordy would go ahead and add some salt. Whoops, I just poured that all over the ground. Maybe a little bit of pepper. We're gonna add a little bit of red pepper flakes. Wow, I feel like him right now, I'm not gonna lie. We got some Hot Ones hot sauce. Not sponsored by them, I just like that show. Then we're gonna go in with a little bit of the garlic. We got some nice big chunky chunks of garlic. Now we're gonna add some sweet chili sauce and some maple syrup. It's gonna be a sweet little sauce. But this is pretty sweet for me. The sweet chili sauce and the maple syrup, we'll see. So I'm gonna finish it with some of this lime juice and we're gonna take it off the heat. All right, now we're moving on to our cauliflower, and he said to use just half a cauliflower. This is a pretty small one, so I don't know. So the way good old Gordon said to do this is to first remove the stem, and he pointed this out in his video, which I love. Don't just throw away your stem. You can save them and use them for vegetable stock. Save your stems. You can also just use them in this recipe. The reason we're not using them is because we want the end, the aesthetic at the end that he had, but you could totally chop these up and also just add these into the recipe if you wanted to. Then he went through and he just cut out, again, these little stems. Let's quickly put together our little dry ingredient mix so that I can just toss the cauliflower right in there when I'm done with it. We got some rice flour. It's gonna help to fry it up. Some salt and pippa. Okay, we've got these all broken down and now we're just going to mix up our cauliflower. Okay, now it's time to fry. For those of you who know me, you know I do not like to work with hot oil because it scares me. And for those of you who don't know me, hi, welcome. Hope you're having a great time. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and add in my vegetable oil. And then I've also got some sesame oil. I think it's heated up enough, I'm gonna add in our cauliflower. And then as Gordon said, every time you add cauliflower, you're gonna cool down the pan. You can bring down the temperature. And then these little baddies are gonna get crispy. Now he had a good saute pan going. But do what you want. I mean, the way he does it with one arm is way cooler than what I'm doing, this like sifting for gold method. But both work just fine. So if you're spooked by hot oil, you don't have to feel bad about it. As it was, as it was. Okay, they're starting to crisp up nicely. I'm just flipping these around so that the cauliflower florets get equally fried on all sides. Okay, so I'm gonna take this off the heat. 
And now all that's left to do is to add our sauce and give these a try. Get all those good juices out. And then the last thing to do is just spoon our bang bang sauce right on top. It looks beautiful, there's so many colors. The bang bang sauce really fills it out color wise. Wow. <laughs> Gordon, how could you? I mean, it, it, there, there is no resemblance to chicken, like bang bang chicken, in any way, shape or form, none, other than the sauce. But it doesn't matter. You won't even be thinking about chicken. This is absolutely delicious. It's a lot of oil. It tastes damn good. This cauliflower is perfectly cooked too. Gordon, you devil dog, you. So likeness to bang bang chicken, if that's what we're doing here, four, three, nothing like chicken, but this is delicious flavor-wise, really good. I think my one qualm is that I feel like I'd feel very heavy. There's a lot of oil in this recipe. I think the overall taste, overall dish, I'll give it like an eight out of 10, which is very good. It's very tasty. It's just a little heavy on the oil and the sweetness for me, for me. Like I would make this on a special occasion when people are coming over, but not on the daily for myself at home. If you have another recipe you want me to try and let you know if it's actually good, then pop over to my Instagram and send me a nice little DM. That's where I accept like all of my requests. I also do some shout outs there sometimes asking you guys for recipes, so head over there. Join my Discord if you wanna hang out with me. I'm on there almost every single day. And I'm now streaming on Twitch, so come watch my Twitch streams. I play Minecraft, I play Animal Crossing, I do study with me slash work with me streams, like Pomodoro style. We have a lot of fun and all that jazz. Okay, I'm out of here. Bye bye.